that proves that women by their nature can get pregnant because the simple fact that she can't shows you that there is something wrong. This is what is known as the exception that proves the rule. Whereas if a male with a penis can't get pregnant, no doctor on earth is going to run tests to see what's wrong with him. Matt a absolument tué ce débat. C'était étonnant. Ouah, c'était impressionnant. J'ai adoré le ton de la conversation. If you, if you, if you meet a person on the street who only has one leg, Maybe, maybe they had an accident, maybe they were in war, maybe, maybe, some, you know, maybe they were in a car accident, maybe they had cancer, a leg was cut off. But you know that something went wrong because of the, by their nature, they're supposed to have two legs. Same thing for a woman. A woman by her nature can get pregnant. A man by his nature never can. So if you meet a woman of childbearing age, say she's 28 years old, and she can't get pregnant, you know automatically that something has gone wrong. And she can go to the doctor and find out what that thing is, even if they can't fix it. So... That proves that women by their nature can get pregnant because the simple fact that she can't shows you that there is something wrong. This is what is known as the exception that proves the rule. Whereas if a male with a penis can't get pregnant, no doctor on earth is going to run tests to see what's wrong with it. J'adore. Tellement simple. Je vois pas où il y a des problèmes t'es une femme ou t'es un homme. Merci Matt Walsh, enfin du bon sens. Bravo Monsieur Matt. Voilà une explication simple et efficace. C'est vraiment incroyable d'avoir ce genre de débat aujourd'hui mais chapeau le monsieur a des vrais arguments un homme c'est un homme pareil pour la femme. <musique>